What's going on guys, Sayincraft Studios here with Devlog Day 8. Man are we getting close, and man am I getting bad at getting these devlogs in on at the actual Day 8. On my time zone, technically we are one minute away from Day 9. That's okay, everyone's in different time zones, nobody cares. This is my progress for Day 8. This is going to be a shorter one than usual, I, do, I had a very busy day, uh, and I'll have a busy day tomorrow working on this, uh, adding mini games. But today I had a busy day with other things, so there's not too much to show, so this one should be quicker. Uh, the first thing I have right off the bat to show you is uh, before, when you uh, joined a game, it was you just joined the same game. There was no matchmaking, nothing. Uh, now you can actually um, choose your name, and then you can actually join a match. Now matches that already exist will show up over here, and yeah, you can play around with the pieces on the main menu here. Uh, you can, if no one's there, you create a name. I'm going to call this PP because I'm mature. Four, uh, this is how many people can join it. Let's say four, that's a good number. Uh, so this is my name, PC test. Uh, it says PP. Uh, and then you click start. And here we are in the world. Uh, the world itself is mostly the same. Uh, I fixed the bug with the other magic dice. Uh, where that, that now works properly if you saw the bug alert in the previous devlog. Uh, pretty well everything else is the same. I haven't even changed the dialogue here with the nice art art by uh, Bag Milk. Uh, Chris says the same uh, epic funny joke. Uh, let's see if we can get on first try what I actually added. Nope, we can't. Uh, so there are no new mini games because I, I was very busy and mini games are probably going to be some of the bigger, bigger, more tiresome, tedious things to add. Uh, but I did add something to enhance the experience of the mini games, which uh, hopefully I can get uh, soon. Uh, here we go. You're about to see it. -na -na -na. It's got a random mini game selector. So now it's not set mini games. Now every time you land on a mini game spot, uh, if the thing rotates with a rope to represent rope burn and you know question marks for this random. And you get the random mini game. Oh, and I landed on the dice so we can show off how perfect uh, the the lack of bugs are. Oh, and we've already got a mini game, so we lose the dice. Anyway, so we've got that bug fixed. We got matchmaking. Uh, we have uh, and we have random mini game selectors. Now the game's really getting up there. The game's almost done kind of almost done as much as I can for now. I still have a bunch of mini games to add which is going to be a big feat. Uh, a lot of uh, minor artistic things like the UI needs work, uh, minor stuff, some bug fixes. Uh, I need to change how the, the dice is rolled. But other than that, the game is getting close to how I actually wanted it to be for the game jam. Uh, obviously compromises had to be made but it's going well so far. Uh, yeah, I'm going to make that the end of day 8. Uh, because I need to go to bed and wake up early to get my core selections in for U of T. Uh, thank you, U of T, for making that so stressful. Good night, everyone. See you next time.